Hello YouTube, Zeke here, and welcome back to Hand of Fate. Let's not wait any longer here, and let's get started in this episode. Yes, of course, we will continue in story mode. Alright, so King of Dust is done. We are now taking care of Jack of Scales. Uh, let's see what we get in terms of curses. Unfortunately, last time we were getting a curse that our gold was getting stolen. Uh, one, was it? one gold for every 15 health that we had. And so we were losing about 6 or 7 gold uh, every encounter that we were having. This time we have a mana drain. So cooldown times for weapons and artifacts uh, are doubled. Which is not too bad because I think we're not relying on them so much. And uh, last man standing, so in every combat, uh, the last enemy alive can no longer be stunned or interrupted. Okay, so we'll have to be careful about that. Uh, I think that we're going to notice that the little, I don't know, the little waves that appear over his head uh, that kind of give you a warning that uh, something's coming um, will probably be red. And that just means in that case, uh, we're going to have to avoid, evade, do whatever it is that we do normally uh, to get out of the way. All right, let's just do a quick review of the weapons. So here we have our two new weapons, Life's Limb and uh, Scorching Zeal. We have the two shields, which are good. And then the rest of the, uh, the, rest of the equipment here. Um, otherwise, up here, these are not worth it. These are not worth it. Um, inspect 23 no. so the rest of these are really not all that worth it the shields well we might as well just take two shields we're not going to take three in this case and we're not going to change anything else so let's get started jack of scales um, what we're likely going to do um, noticing that the levels are getting longer and longer in this case so they're no longer just three levels or four levels. Uh, we may split this into, um, I'll say, multiple episodes. It's, not, it's probably not going to go more than two episodes, but we're probably going to split it in two episodes because it gets kind of long. Um, not long in a boring sense, just long in a... Um, just in a... Uh, it's, it's taking a long time to get through. All right. Uh, let's go this way. What do we have here? A uh, stranger in the shadows. The On a dark moonless night down a lonely road, you encounter a hooded stranger. Greetings, friend. I'm in need of some sustenance. Uh, would you be willing to offer some of your vigor in exchange for gold, he asks, uh, taking out a bag of coin. Hmm. Sure. Stranger moves uh, with unnatural speed to grasp uh, you firmly and bite your throat. After a few seconds, he releases you. Okay, mm that was weird. <clears throat> that was good enough. Um, mm, no, I think, uh, I think we're good. I'm not going to take that much. Uh, yeah, sorry, buddy. I mean, I was willing to let you... Twisted Canyon. All right, so we can get a weapon out of this if we're lucky. Yes, we will attempt to climb down. Only one chance out of four to uh, to screw this up, and we're good. So let's see what we go get down there. Uh, one equipment card. Okay, so we got the Frost Fang. That's nice. Damage 28. We're definitely going to hang on to that, and we're going to equip it. That was probably the best approach. Um, so we have a little bit of wasted food here, but that's kind of how it is. Mr. Lionel. Um, what is he going to give us? Okay, so while enjoying the... I'm not going to reread everything that happened He's here. We've read this a few times already. Um, alright, so what are we going to give him? Well, I always go with the ask him what he needs. Yeah, that's fine. Alright. I have a feeling that Okay, okay. Uh, whenever the player receives healing, they also gain a plus one gold. Um, no benefit if they were already fully healed. Um, yeah, I don't think that, no, that probably wasn't worth reading completely through anyways. All right, so we know where the exit is. We're kind of wasting all of our food here. But uh, we have Ratman hunting. So uh, let's see what we can deal with on uh, this card. So we have uh, Four of Plague. 
very manageable but this is going to be our first uh, our first take on um let's see there we go and yeah, skip that all right combo whoa combo these yeah they all kind of have a, an attack that's uh, that can't really be dodged or anything ow that hurt Right. Um. Ah, that hurt. These rats are annoying with their knives. Oh, he got three. Well, he took a lot on me. <clears throat> I always have trouble dealing with those ranged attacks. Okay, we're going to start getting some healing. Unfortunately, or... F well, maybe we're going to get food out of this battle anyways. Okay, so... Um, yeah, we're gonna have to go back. Yeah, we got the plus one gold when that happens. That's good. Another plus one. Another plus one. And now we get the ladder. All right, let's move on to the next level. That's correct. We're moving down. I good. I like efforts. the linear map so much better. I worked hard <clears throat> Most optimal maps possible. Yes, yes, yes. Dead Man's nothing. Gorge. Alright, while crossing the ancient rope bridges of Dead Man's Gorge, you hear sounds of movement from below. Uh, it's an ambush. It's an ambush, and we have two of skulls. Could have been much worse. Not going to complain about this. Alright, what do we have waiting for us here? And where are... Oh, they're all the way at the other end there, aren't they? Alright, one. Take you out. Sneak by you. Whoa! Can't see much with these, uh... And... Oh, I got in time. Okay, so that's exactly what I was expecting. So the last man standing curse. Uh, basically, you get those red indicators over his head. That just means that you can't parry it. You can't... Well, you can dodge it, obviously, but you can't parry it. Alright, so what do we get? Three additional food. That's very well comed. So is the five. Okay. We're okay. We didn't get any additional gold, but this is definitely worth it. So we get a traveling jeweler. Um, we may just stop and uh, sell off our first primary weapon that we had. Uh, I don't think we're going to be able to buy, buy much for 26 gold, but uh, let's check out what they have available. So we're going to sell items right away. And... What are we going to... Damage 25. Is that not what we have? Inventory. I thought we had the Frost Fang. Did we not have the Frost Fang? Where's the Frost Fang? That is... Okay, that's really weird. I'm pretty sure we pulled out a frost fang. All right, well, let's back out of this. I thought I should have noticed when I was doing like the combat there, noticing that we didn't. I didn't really notice what it looked like. All right, well, let's see if we can at least get another weapon out of this. <clears throat> All right, it's so one monster card. Our old friend, the Jack of Plague. Ah, yes, the Jack of Plague. Of All right, fair enough. So let's see what we can get out of this. These guys are really annoying. Yikes. Okay. Really annoying. It's the guy with the arrows over here that's annoying. He's annoying. One. Yikes. Okay. We're dying. We're dying here. We're dying. We're dying. We're dying. We're dying horribly here. Dodge. 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 Get out of the way. Get out of the way and get him out. Yeah. Oh, yeah, that's going to hurt. Yeah. 
these are the guys that I hate so much. Get out of his way. Wow, we almost died in that battle. I can't believe it. 13 health. That's ridiculous. Are we going to get any kind of gain cards out of this at least? Um, <clears throat> nothing. We get nothing. All right, we're back up to 19. I'm not sure the dead fighting back me. All right, you see an ancient ornate coffin that, uh, in the main burial chamber. Uh, it may hold spectacular wealth, uh, but it will surely be guarded. Two monster cards, great. Um, all right, so we're going to attempt to take them by surprise. Hopefully... Ye Ooh... I could not get any luckier on that. Suddenly you leap uh, into the fray, taking one of them down before they can even react. Um, dust. We'll go after... Oh, of course. I hate it when they sneak it by like that. You pick one, it doesn't give you the other one. Alright, we're going to need to... Take you out while I'm at it. Take you out. Whoa! Alright, which ones are... He's staying back there, isn't he? Oh, we're almost dead now. All right. And that was horrible. That was absolutely horrible. All right, we're going to Yes, I'm yeah, I'm aware of that. Thank you for that. I would like to thank the um I forget what they were. All right, we're starting over again. I'm beginning to admire your methods. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Stop, please. I would have done things differently. I'm sure you would It'd have. You who buckles first. All right, let's try this again. My hero. Everything in the Jack's domain. Jack of Scales is fine. It was those ranged attacks that was killing us. It was insane. It was the the plague, right? It was the rats. Usually I was able to deal with them usually, the but I don't know what happened this time. Like All right. Found. <clears throat> uh, on a dark moonless night, uh, down a lonely road, you encounter a hooded stranger greetings friend. Uh, I'm in need of sustenance. You are not getting anything from me. Sorry, you have to leave because I'm going to need all the health that I can. Clearly, because we're not focused enough today. Uh, marketplace. Uh, not going to stop at the marketplace because um, we're going to keep all of our food. We're not going to. Actually, could we still have the food? All right, we'll still have the food. Oh, uh, we have a chance of failure. Let's go with option three, which is success. Very happy about that. Uh, two gold cards fill 15 gold and another 15 gold. So that's nice. All right, that worked out nicely. Let's move on. Enough with this messing around. Heroes remains. You pass a funeral, it's obvious from the size of the procession uh, that the deceased was a well-loved figure. You are approached by a cleric. Um, this great hero uh, fell defending our beloved town, uh, Wondermere. Uh, his sword and shield are powerful artifacts and must be returned to his hometown for the proper burial rites to be completed. Will you do this, traveler? Uh, Alright, so we're going to take the belongings. Thank you for this. Uh, this will mean the world to our family. Uh, the town would be revolted had these artifacts not been returned. Uh, it's not far for the hero's hometown. Um, look for the town cleric when you get there. Okay, fair enough. Viking blade. Wow. Anger. You wouldn't expect uh, barbarian hordes. Would you like to equip the Vi Yeah, we might as well take the viking blade while we can keep it. I did accept it, didn't I? I did. Last time, I don't know why. I didn't, I didn't pick it up. Uh, yeah, we're going to take those two. Or we're going to equip it. Yes. So, in theory, now... What do we have here? Heavy burden. Uh, after... 
Let us see how you After five steps, player loses 50% max health. Oh, we didn't expect that. Great. Still, Heroes return. Um, does that mean we have to go back there? No, we're not going to continue. So if we turn back right now, does that mean we have to go back down there and that was it? Maybe we're going to get something for it. All right, let's go down here. Reveal Heroes Return. That's fine. We're going to go there. Return. Yeah, we weren't really going to use it anyways, right? Uh, thank you. The blade uh, will once again be wielded uh, in righteous fury. Do you also have his shield? Yeah, we're going to return his shield as well. Two blessing cards. All right. High contusion. No, high constitution. Whenever the player eats food, uh, they gain twice the usual healing. Perfect. And Headman's Blessing, uh, any kill made using an axe, grants a player three health. Okay, good. That's good. All right, so we got a token out of that. That's wonderful. I feel so much better now. Woohoo. We're only down to six food, unfortunately, so we can probably find, or five food, I should say. <coughs> we should probably consider finding a uh, merchant of sorts although we are completely it is completely out of our control and we're right in the middle of a horrible map right now so local peasant we're going to take that that's perfect while crossing the forest da -da -da. greeting stranger uh, the winter grass uh, has been hard on my family a few years uh, in the forest behind her you sense movement uh, no I'm sorry I'm not going to give you anything I, mean, I can't give you food I have no food I'm not going to give you anything if I had something, cave mouth. I mean, I suppose I could just go out. That's what we were looking for anyways, right? <clears throat> All right, so we're exiting now. I can't really afford to go through the map. All right, here we go. <clears throat> rat men hunting. I just need some kind of... All right, so we get six for the rats. This is what I'm worried about. For some reason, I'm having more trouble with these guys than any others. Alright, so if we dodge these things... One... Whoa! There we go. And this guy's taken out completely. Alright, none of them are actually attacking us in a... Uh... You're out. Dodge out of the way for you. And same for you. And that's it. As long as they don't have the ranged attackers, we can we can manage fairly well. At least I feel that we can. All right, please get some gold. No, not gold. Please get some food. We need food. We need food. We need food. Uh, you size, you search the bodies, finding nothing. Of course, we're about to die again. Devil's Carnival. Frivolity is not my forte. One day, um, just as dust gathers, you reach a larger, um, a large country fair, country town, yeah, hosting a traveling circus. Strange sights. Uh, all right, so this is the part where we may get lost. So we go here. Huge success. Okay, good. We're gonna we're gonna get it with a huge success. Cheers. Um, tears and gaps draw you to a large tent. Inside, you discover a number of spectacles being performed uh, by costumed artists. Huge failure. Huge. No, no, no. Let's go with option number three this time. It is a failure. So, uh, unseen hands uh, relieve you of some of your gold and watch a fine white horse being commanded to perform a variety of tricks from the go uh, from the gopping crowd. Um. All right, so they're going to remove some gold from us. Lose 30% gold. Uh, sometime later, you find yourself standing at the edge of the forest. The sounds of the crowds behind you, days, um, day just as dawning. But which day? Okay, so obviously we're lost in terms of where we are. We ran into that last time. It worked out much worse for us. Oh, couldn't get any luckier, could we? All right, so we have 28 gold. We're going to buy as much food as we can. As much as we can now. 
I don't really care about our weapons at this point. Yeah. 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 You know exactly where we're at. Uh, buy items. Buy food. I'm going to buy tons of food. We don't have enough food for that. What is this for? 10 food? 30. Oh, of course, because we lost all our money, right? So, buy one. Food buy two. For healing. Three. If you travel four. Food, your five. Not be restored six. Seven. Also begin to starve. It seems you'll learn that soon enough. Though. Yep. We're good. We'll be fine with this. Thank you for this. Um, we're in a bad spot. We're going to have to waste one food just going back one. But then we go up and we get the stairs. Okay. That's good. Downwards, if you dare. Um, I think we'll do one more level. We can probably manage one more level. And it's linear, so it's perfect. All, All right. Ratman hunting. So after this level, we're probably going to put a pause in the uh, or cut in the uh, in the episode because it's it's getting a little long. So one monster card, four of plague. I'd like to fight some of the scales. I saw the scale guys before, but they were just unfortunately we were in a bad situation. One here. That worked out nicely. Block you. Block you. Take you out while we're at it. Where are you? Where are you? And we get to attack him back at least when we do that. And there we go. So we didn't take any damage at all. Everything was blocked. Oh, yeah, plus three health. There we go. That's fine. What do we get out of this? Something, please. Find nothing. We're finding less and less. Uh, traveling Tinker. Hmm, there's nothing to buy, so we're going to pass it by, unfortunately. What do we have here? Mr. Lionel. Are running low. Can you press on? Uh, I have no choice but to press on. Ask him what he needs. Oh, he just took our shield. We should have just ignored him. I didn't think he could take our shield. Healing will suffice, however. Great. Now we have no shield. Noble trader. A challenge for you, and a token if you succeed. Hmm. Now we have no food, and we have the force escape. All right. So this is this is officially it for this level. I'm um, not quite sure how we're going to manage in the next one, but right now it's not looking good. We have no shield. We have no food. We have no gold. We have all our health, though. Uh, we're going to have to deal with them first, though, aren't we? So, four, seven of dust. Seven of dust without a shield on. So, it's going to be all about dodging now. Take this. Sure, why not? Whoa. There's traps up there. Didn't see those. One. Whoa. We gotta get out of the way here. Oh, they didn't see that. No, that hurt. So that's another thing that we can't see anymore. Is the possible attacks that could be coming our way. Like these. We just have to anticipate absolutely everything now without a shield on. No, I can't dodge. Ooh, I think it took him out just in time. Alright, so it's still very manageable with our shield, but we have a horrible weapon and nothing to protect ourselves with. So it's looking very bad. Uh, one gain card, max health plus five. Could have used some health. Alright, so uh, we're going to put a pause here in the episode. Um, hopefully we get to survive this next level. We had a really rough time in the first time, but uh, hopefully it... Uh, works out a little bit better next time. So, hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, please give a like, and I will see you guys in the next episode. Take care. Bye-bye.